It's play action for Gilbert on first down, and he dumps it off across the 30-yard line. 16th overall selection, 22 years old. Run it again here between the tackles on second and 12. Here we get and a penalty marker down as the play clock hits zero. Office number three. Five-yard penalty to third down. Dallas 34. Gilbert. Pocket breaks down, so Gilbert takes off, being chased by Golden. His pass tipped and incomplete. Chris Strebler was the backup last year. He's the number three this year. Here's a swing pass to Rondale Moore, the rookie out of Purdue. Quick throw by McCoy, and the pass is caught, and then it's popped free by Keanu Neal. Max Williams caught it, then fumbled it, and the Cowboys have it at midfield. So the Cowboys take over in Arizona territory. It'll be Pollard here, and he's got a hole. Pollard picks up about nine on the play. So here's Gilbert. Started one game last year, spent a lot of time in the Browns practice squad, throwing a third down and ten. Wide open in the middle of the field is Gallup, but he dropped it. But electing to keep the offense on the field, the play clock winding down. Mike McCarthy might call timeout. Nope, they snap it. Gilbert. Gets rid of it, and Gallup open again, and it's a first down inside the 30-yard line. Midway point of the first quarter, second down and nine. Gilbert dumping it off to Dowdle out in space. Breaks down Whitaker, and finally brought down. Here they come. Gilbert gets it away, and it's dropped. Dallas just picked up a fourth down and ten. Ball again. Gilbert picking it up at the last second, almost picked off. The Cardinals will take over on downs. Jonathan Ward in the backfield with Edmonds, and McCoy taking a shot downfield for Kirk, and it's caught at midfield and knocked out of bounds. Or the 49th pick in the NFL draft out of Purdue two, uh, three years ago at 114 catches in 2018 with the Boilermakers. Edmonds trying to get the perimeter. And then on the cutback, he dropped a yard short of the line to gain by Carlos Watkins. So it'll be third down and a yard here for Arizona. Third down and a yard here for the Cardinals with McCoy under center. And McCoy off play action, dumps it off. Edmonds first down. Skips Colt McCoy four of five through the air. Had that 37-yard pass to Christian Kirk. See Edmonds shifting out of the backfield. And here's another pitch to Rondale Moore on the run. Going to get a lot of work tonight. No James Conner in this game. Play action, though, here on third down and one. And McCoy, two more for a first down. Colt McCoy's been very sharp here. Getting the start. Preseason game number one. McCoy in trouble and sack back at the 15-yard line. It was Dorrance Armstrong. From about 33 yards. Replacing Zane Gonzalez, and his first attempt is good, and the Cardinals are on the board first. It'll be a pass play, and Gilbert's pass is caught. That's Nick Ralston with Dowdle the tailback, and Dowdle straight ahead gets the first down. Watching the offense and trying to figure out where he's supposed to go, or is it about physicality as we watch Gilbert throw a completion here to Brown? Look at this, baby. Seven on They back off. Third down. Gilbert's arm hit as he throws deep. And what a pass on target to Cedric Wilson. And Jordan Phillips, assuming both guys are healthy enough to go September 12th against the Titans week one. Gilbert to the air on second and ten. Dumps it off. Inside the 20. Simmons top 10 pick last year. Number eight overall. Collins 16th this year. Gilbert from the pocket. And the pass is wide of the target. It's fourth down. And nice wander hits it. Jonathan Ward is the running back next to Colt McCoy. Who's looked good so far. Getting the start tonight. McCoy to throw it here. Dumps it off to Ward. And past the 35-yard line, gets hit hard. McCoy on second and three, has to step up. And there's Armstrong again, got him. Their offense is special. Not much I know. If Dak Prescott is yes. healthy. 
McCoy on third down, throwing a deep ball, single coverage, way over the head of Rondell Moore, but a flag is down. Actually, two flags are down in the backfield as Colt McCoy got hit. Personal foul, roughing the passer, deep at number 56. 15 yard penalty, automatic first down. Put James Conner in the backfield, Chase Edmonds, and let him run downhill. McCoy in trouble. Nope, get So, eight yard loss, third down and 18. And the Cardinals is going to keep it on the ground here with Ward. Gets a chunk of it back. That nickel, that corner nickel is really a starting position in the NFL as far as I'm concerned. Rush dumps it off. Out past the 20 yard line. The Cardinals are pretty bullish on the secondary, even though no Pat P now with the Vikings. Third down and one. Rush going to keep it here and slides to about the 29 before. Malcolm Butler had, what, 100 tackles last season. Rush swings it to Dowdle, and Dowdle up to the 38, lost the ball. Players diving on it at the 38-yard line. Looked like there was a Cardinal there first. Who knows how many reps you're going to get in these preseason games. Strebler throws complete inside the 30-yard line. Rondell Moore with his fifth touch already. Quarterback. Here's third down and three with the play clock winding down. Strebler takes off doing what he does best inside the 10 and he lowers the boom on the defender. Benjamin gonna find the end zone. Touchdown, Cardinals. Is he tougher than our guy Feely? On, on oh, no, I don't know. Jay, Let's Jay, not get carried I away. was gonna say, Jay might is probably the toughest Cardinal kicker we've had, at least since we've been here. As Rush throws a nice pass. For a completion out to the Jack Allen, Lucky Fotu, those are you know, those in positions in the 3-4. That's a position Dogby plays as Boyce caught inside the 40-yard line. How many targets? Don't though? worry about the targets. <laughs> 24. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Dowdle on third and seven. A good play by Banjo. Right on the ball, baby. That, that's some blood farming right there. What? Rush on second down, pass is caught, and... And putting the cage right on the pig, we call that blood farming. Third and three, Rush from the pocket, and in traffic, incomplete. It'll be fourth down, we'll see what the Cowboys do here. Penalty flag is down. 38-yard field goal, Tribe, a hundred nice wander, made one earlier in the quarter. And that's good also. Strebler has a wide open receiver and a diving catch made. Get here's, his arms down, David. As an offensive lineman, you're talking. Yeah. Second and ten. Strebler. That pass on the money. Eight on the line of scrimmage. Seven are coming, and Strebler throws it up in the air, incomplete, over the head. I think the leadership is clear. You, you see uh, these older guys, these more experienced players. Strebler and you know, I, I think Colt McCoy we've talked about it he's been terrific help for, for Kyler and we'll see that hopefully next week Michael. and then we get an extra playoff spot you know wild card spot in each conference so I think that's going to benefit the teams in the NFC West and what we've got to do there we go. Benjamin taking off had a touchdown in the first half and they finally catch him you know, he's, he's really bought into the organization. He's a true leader, and, and uh, it's, it's just awesome. Flag down, Strebler down as well. Let's who the penalty's about. Might be offside. It's going to be a first down for the Cardinals. Well, I want to finish my answer about the expectations for this year because the expectations are to win. And we've got to eliminate those senseless penalties. You know, it's one of the reasons we didn't. We probably haven't talked about Matt Prater enough, or our kicker. So it's a it's a buy before the season starts. Then you've got your normal buy, and then you've got your Thursday night sort of mini buy. Green Bay Packers will be here for Thursday night game at State Farm Stadium this year, October 28th. And he's all tied it up. <laughs> 28 yarder is good and it's 13 6 Cardinals Michael thanks so much at the Rams September October 3rd excuse me Cooper rush with a completed pass to Turner breaks a tackle stepped out right now you're just trying to make a play to grab the attention of a coach on second and one they run it and a big hit in the backfield 
but Hardy still going, gets the first down. Got a fullback in there now in front of Hardy. First down on the Dallas 39. Rush will throw it. And going deep, under thrown, and it's caught at the 30-yard line. The ball comes out at the end, but they're going to say that the catch was completed by Reggie Davis. It's and it was interesting to see him actually hold down that starting position on the first depth chart that was released by the Cardinals. Rush's pass out of bounds. Yeah. Knowledge of not just the offense, but the entire program. He's the face of the Dallas Cowboys, and... Hey, listen, man, if you're willing to acknowledge what it is that confronts you, your odds of beating it get a lot better. Ward with a nice cut to the outside. When the Cardinals were 6-3 and three, after the Hale Murray against Buffalo, he was in the MVP conversation. The question is Strebler's pass is caught, and Ward is dragged down. Does that mean you're never going to have Kyler Murray run the ball? Of course not. Does that mean you don't want him to extend plays and use his legs to pick? And Brian Winters, a veteran, Josh Jones, who's now in his second NFL season, and Strebler is nowhere to go here. And this falls forward. But still, my goodness, Rodney Hudson, this guy is disciplined. He's a pro's pro. He's physical. There's a huge play. He's hard. Ben DiNucci, by the way, is the new. You're going to bring me on your patch pod, whatever it is. I'm asking you questions. Nice move by Knox. When you lose Dak Pratt, when you lose your franchise quarterback, you become a very average team. Danucci's pass, boy, that was an excellent throw, but he's a good player. Again, that throw was on the money. He had a really good career in college. And another excellent pass. This time it's caught for a first down, and then a flag comes in. He's a good player. Again, that throw was on the money. He had a really good career in college. And another excellent pass. This time it's caught for a first down, and then a flag comes in. Fehoko, rookie out of Stanford, fifth-round pick, made the catch. He's a good player. Again, that throw was on the money. He had a really good career in college. And another excellent pass. This time it's caught for a first down, and then a flag comes in. Fehoko, rookie out of Stanford, fifth-round pick, made the catch. He had as many rushing touchdowns in his career as you did when he's a defensive <laughs> lineman. Give the guy a break. Third down and six. Danucci forced out of the pocket. And he's going to keep it and easily get the first down. Scoot forced to play three of their initial four games away from home. At Tennessee, at Jacksonville, and at the Rams. Straight ahead. First down, maybe a touchdown. We'll see if they mark. Play fake. Danucci with time, touch pass, beautiful touchdown. Cowboys have the lead. Brandon Smith. After last season, everybody playing in empty stadiums, it's an incredible feeling to have these fans back, to have the energy, to have the excitement. Um, but in terms of playing, it's just been fun to watch these guys go at it. Um, there's been good football being played. There's been some, and I know how to lift him up if he's having a tough time, or I know how to give him a little kick in the ass if he needs a kick in the ass. <laughs> so uh, it's just each guy's different, and you got to handle it. Strebler on the run, dumps it off. Big hit, out of bounds as Michelli goes. I can't even believe you ripped me off and you what took you, my what? Tennessee Titans. What are you talking about? I didn't know that's what you were going to say. Oh my so what? So agree. Pass is caught at the 42-yard line. That's Dorch on the catch. Trying to point out that if Prater kicks a field goal and the game's tied, everybody's just going to be fine. Strebler from the pocket. What a grab made in traffic. Honestly, have you ever held your, a football? Your questions are very Bill Walton-esque. I, mean, I think you're going to ask if I've been if I've been to Vienna in the summertime. <laughs> I have no it's, idea what you're talking about. A cover three guy plays the middle of the field. He's really changing his stripes. Blitz on third and 12. Strebler moving to his right. And an almost catch. Will they bring everybody here? Strebler from the pocket gets sacked. Flag is down, though. Prior to the snap, full start. Offense number 38. Five-yard penalty. He'll force So now, now they're going to bring on Prater. Now his 15th NFL season. And that is gorgeous. 
Cardinals did that a lot last year. They lost Trent Sherfield. He was one of their key guys on their kick cover team. We'll see if they continue to do it, though, this year. You would think that Jeff Rogers is a coach. That pass tip. Zayvon Collins and Isaiah Simmons, their length and their athleticism, getting their hands on the ball. Eubanks. And they get the football back with some time and a chance to win the game themselves. Cardinals blitz. Danucci throws incomplete. Can he stand in the pocket, make some throws? Now he's a chance to do that, help win a game, albeit a preseason game. Quarterback draw. Talked about his running ability. And yes, that was eight years ago, but just last year he made a 59 yarder to win a game. Third and five. Option. Strebler pitches it. First down. Andy Lee to hold. And it is good. And the Cardinals win it.